Hey guys, Silent Seo here. Welcome back to another Utame Cross Gacha video. So today we don't have anything too important regarding um, major updates to the game. So let's dive straight into the Gacha page and talk about Makina's brand new episode plate. Is it actually um, worth your Singing Stone investments or maybe your physical cash if you're able to purchase um, in-game currency? So as you can tell, <laughs> we don't get a lot of illustrations with our uh, Ragna Neko friends and yeah Makina's episode plate is the one of few rare ones that we actually get such love for the other species <laughs> uh, I, the, I don't really like the pre-evolution illustration it, it feels very bare minimum um, could have been a lot more attractive I guess but you know even the fully evolved one it's decently composed um, you know with uh, rules of third and all that kind of stuff but anyways enough of all the photography talk and you know um, illustration wise purposes uh, let's talk about the episode plate so 3797 total score that is plus 25 luck value without this plus 25 luck it comes in at 3547 so if you actually watch um, Min Mei's gacha video, you would know that Makina's episode plate is only one point lower <laughs> than Min Mei's episode plate. But let's compare, um, you know, the rest of the other things available on this episode plate that Min Mei might not have. So, first thing off, you know, yes, Makina's episode plate isn't as selfish as Min Mei's episode plate. Because uh, it can be used by the other three div different divas and one Basara, uh, if you don't call him a diva. <laughs> um, and of course, the episode plate, just like Min Mei, it focuses on voice. Then, of course, Charm takes the second place. And of course, So takes the harsh dive down the lane of points. So, center scale wise, pretty much similar to Min Mei. Um, unit's voice is boosted by 90% up, so does it actually have an active skill that might make it better than Min Mei's? Sadly to say, no, it's technically almost the same, <laughs> but the only difference is the life skill. So if you still are not familiar with the brand new life skill, this is the one that requires your um, Viva's affection levels to be maxed out to give you that very good 120% boost in score. So yes, so if you have Min Mei, uh, not Min Mei, uh, Min Mei is not here, Makina, <laughs> Reina, Cheryl or Basara with their affections maxed out, this episode play is definitely going to help you out greatly with the current um, high score event uh, for div diva improvement. So if you don't have an episode play like this, I mean so far technically there's about 4 episode plates now that has this life skill if I'm not wrong. Uh, I think it's 4, it might be 3, I don't know. If, if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments down below. I can't really remember on the top of my head how many episode plays that has this live skill now. But, you know, it's been coming up gradually, um, you know, episode plays that has this live skill. So hopefully you guys have been busy, you know, using up all the affection points to max out your favorite waifu or husband those affections. Because um, now it's definitely going to be in need to give you a good high score. So let's take it to the last page, sadly to say, no special notes attached to it, um, which is fine because it is a brand new life skill so we can't expect Dana to like be tossing out fantastic episode plates um, when they just introduce something brand new, but who knows, look at the 7 star episode plates, we were tossed out 7 star plates with special notes attached to them um, quite recently as well and you know, with a fairly good brand new set of 7 star episode plates as well. Oh, what was that? <laughs> Neighbors knocking away. Anyways, um, that's about it for the episode plate. Is it worth your money? Technically, yes, if you don't have anything that is similar in terms of life skill. Uh, it is definitely way better than Min Mei's episode plate. So sadly to say, Min Mei fans, your waifu has just been outed by Makina. <laughs> and her, her, well, her sea friend <laughs> stealing presents. Oh my god, is he a Grinch? <laughs> Anyways, um, if it's worth your money, um, definitely, um, if you, as, like I said, if you don't have an episode play like this, it's definitely good to have uh, one on hand, just in case. Uh, yeah, and 
it's definitely better than Min Mei's episode plate. So if you're deciding between the two to pull, um, like I said in Min Mei's video, her costume points are given in the episode plates of the events. So technically, this episode plate isn't that important. Makinas is the most important, and of course, looking at the stats and the skill, um, it's definitely way better than Min Mei's uh, in terms of versatility and usefulness. So, Makina is the way to go! So even if you are not a Makina fan and you don't have an episode played with this life skill yet, please go ahead and toss your singing stones into this gacha to try and attain it, especially if you're trying to unlock the costumes for Makina as well. That's definitely the main priority. Uh, if not, you know, you can always save your singing stones for your favorite waifu's future gacha. Well, 2022 is just right the around the corner and tomorrow is Christmas! So since if you guys only watch my Uta Macross videos, I guess Merry Kuri to you guys and a Happy New Year in case I don't release any more other videos for this year. I, I'm still trying to do my gaming content so hopefully I will resume with Monster Hunter Stories 2 or something new. Who knows? Um, I definitely will want to finish all the games that I've left hanging around. You know, it's not nice to leave things hanging around. Uh, so let's dive into the gacha pool itself. Uh, I don't know if I have any Super Dimension tickets that's gonna expire. Oh, 3rd of January? Yeah, I think I can keep it for the New Year's. You know, it's nice to have some luck stored up for 2022. It'd be nice to start off with a big bag. You know, maybe three. Six star episode plates. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hint hint for the new year. Dana, give me some good luck. So here we go with the free daily pool. This is the afternoon session. So we did get a bit of a load bar, but no Valkyrie animation. So that's kind of a bummer. But you know, like I said, uh, I wouldn't want to use up my luck now. Try to start the year with a big bang. Ooh, this is a plate I don't see often. Maybe not. <laughs> Looking at the three digits. Mm. Maybe it hasn't really been passing into my mind uh, because it's one of those episode plays that you get through all the VOP. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's do the single free pool from the featured banner. Oh, no load bars at all. Oh dear. So like I said, the bare minimum I would definitely want is costume points for Makina's brand new Christmas costume. So if you guys don't know what the name of the costume is, it's called Strawberry Carol. Oh, costume points for Ranka's futuristic costume. That is an Uta Macross exclusive. That's nice. Okay, so let's do the discounted pool. I might not do a regular template pool with 500 singing stones because like I said, I would like to save up my singing stones for what's coming in January. I have a feeling it's going to be a Frontier event again, so... Uh, oh, low bars. Decent speed. Hmm. No Valkyries. Okay, so we're running on bad luck for the end of the year. Like I said, December doesn't seem to be my month. What in the world? There's a lot of red boxes. Are we going to see them evolve? Hopefully they don't evolve at all. Okay, first one did not evolve. Alright, some Christmas love from the waifu. That's nice. Alright, who else is getting some love? Okay. Oh, Min Mei is getting some love. Here we go, second red box. Ray Ray is getting some love, so all my waifus are showing some love. So that's fine. Alright. Here's the third red box. No evolution. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we're getting some love from the SDF Macross series. And a bit more Frontier. Oh, the last red box. Yes! Oh, did not evolve. Wow. I, I have to say, I'm, I'm pretty happy that none of the red boxes evolve. Alright, so... Yeah. At least... At least two of my waifus came out, so that's not too bad, even though they are not very... Ooh! Really? I got enough costume points for unlocking Min Mei's costume? Oh, that's nice! So, 
the end of the year didn't end that badly for me. Like I said, I did not want to have good luck now. I would like to save it up for January. So let's see how it is for the first Utah Macross video for 2023. Anyway, 2022. I'm skipping a year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too excited for 2023 because that's when if you guys are Ghostbusters fans like me and you watch all my Ghostbusters videos recently for this year you will know that I'm excited for 2023 because that's when Hasbro Pulse uh, releases the Ghostbusters Afterlife Proton Pack for Egon Spangler so I'm definitely looking forward to 2023 but you know we can't skip 2022 <laughs> <laughs> that's that's not fair to the year. Uh, that it might bring different experiences for each of us. You know, it might be good, it might be bad. But you know, every every experience is a it's a growing experience in our life. So let's not miss any moment in our life. Some life lessons there. <laughs> Anyways, I've got a new costume to unlock, guys. What do you get for your own pools if you did for Makinas? Oh no, I just realized I didn't get any costume points for this. Oh no, do I need to pull? Do I really need to pull a 500 stone pull? Oh no. Why? <laughs> okay, it seems the video is not ending yet. Not yet. Oh, here we go. Oh man. Do I really need to pull? Oh. I would like to save my stones for January though. Oh man. Okay, here we go. I mean, Makina is one of my two waifus in Delta. I mean, you can't have Reyna without Makina. Or vice versa, you know. Oh, come on. One, two, three. Oh, don't give me the good luck now. Please. At least just costume points. That's all I request. Okay. The bad luck continues, but I just need costume points. Come on, costume points. No, that's not the one. Oh no, have I wasted all my fire the sing stones? Is December really the, the <laughs> epitome of bad luck for me? And there we go! That is the bad minimum. There we go. Oh, and the red box did not evolve. Look at that. Ozma has the, has the look of relief just like me. <laughs> <laughs> so I got my bare minimum at a very high cost. Oh my goodness, 800 singing stones just for this. Oh. So anyway guys, like I said uh, earlier when I was thinking of ending the video, but let me know as usual in the comments below, how did you do for your own personal pool? Was December good to you? Uh, unlike for me, it has been pretty horrible. Uh, well, we did get a 6 star episode played, but you know, it's none of the featured ones. But it's still nice to get something to fill up the lack of completion on 7 star plates. Um, but hopefully, with all this bad luck going around, I'm still looking forward to 2022 and you know, seeing what Dana has prepared for us in the year ahead. You know, what kind of new modifications aside from like you know the, the screen looking different and making it more confusing for us <laughs> what kind of new gameplay they might eventually come up with um, you know let me know your thoughts for the future of Uta Macross or anything else in the Macross franchise or if you want to talk to me about games and all that and stuff yeah go ahead let me know everything you want to talk about on the comments down below on YouTube or even on Instagram you can DM me there as well uh, or even on YouTube, you know, I'm, I'm always looking around somewhere. <laughs> anyway guys, until then, uh, like I said, have a wonderful holiday, Merry Christmas if you celebrate Christmas, or you know, a Happy New Year. Until then, bye!